Ladies and gentlemen, this is Jason Withlock, understand? The dude that talks about sports like football, basketball, and celebrities and all that stuff, right? Now he claims to be a Christian, understand? That loves God. Now, he gonna talk about huh, that he doesn't care about any other nations or any other country but the United States. And he don't even care about Israel. Now he's focused on America. Listen, America is the one that stood for Israel, right? And now since America done uh, when it gets Israel, it's cursed. So, you mean to tell me, Jason Whitlock, that you don't give a darn about Israel? Now, every other stuff that I heard you say it, like for abortion in the womb and everything. Yeah, I get that. I understand it because I'm against abortion too. But here's the thing though, man. You know, you had people say, well, huh, um, <clears throat> you shouldn't be talking about Israel. I let them talk about, let them handle that and everything. Though. You know what I'm saying? So I do agree with you about like uh, them, them. Who is they to tell you anything? I, I understand that, but I'm gonna tell you. Just, I'm gonna tell you something, though, man. Israel is God's land. Understand? Listen. The reason why I say this is because, man. If you don't know, if you used to read the Bible, you would understand. You would know. That God had gave Israel to Abraham, Isaac, Isaac, and Jacob, understand? And God is going to defend his land, understand? So, therefore, man, since you go do all that, I lost all respect for you too, man. And yeah, you, and then it's like, uh, I'm telling you, man, I don't care if you black, I don't care if you white, I don't care if you, anything in that matter, though, man. I'm going to stand for Israel, though, man. So, yeah, everything, everybody had, had got emotional just because of the situation, right? So I'm not going to sit up here and, and, and be anti-Semitic like you, understand? <laughs> but um, I'm telling you, though, man, I'm praying for you. You need to repent of your wickedness or you're going to end up in hell. I don't know. Huh. You say you're a Christian, though, man. You say you care about uh, things of America. What about uh, what about what's going on with it? Uh, what about the innocent people in Israel? Let's say, what about uh, the people in other, uh, you know, the Bible tells me to pray for the peace of Jerusalem. I'm going to pray for Israel. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Exactly how I am. And now, since you're going to do all that, though, man, you ain't no Christian, man. I know you're going to hear me. You're going to say, who's this This guy come up here and tell me that I'm, I'm anti-Semitic and then, uh, then, then, I ain't, then I'm not standing for Israel. See, look, God says if you stand, if you bless Israel, he will bless you. Now, if you, if you curse Israel, Israel, you'll be cursed. That's what God told Abraham. I'm going to bless those that bless you. I'm going to curse them to curse you. Curse them. So, believe that. So, that's very serious, though, man. So, I'm going to stand with Israel. I don't know about you. I'm going to do what the Lord tell me to do, though, man. And God is, it's a whole lot of anti-Semitic folks out here. You are one of them, man. Yes, you are. Hmm. I'm praying for you, man.